Yes, yeah, so the U.S. Marshals say they were doing surveillance outside a home in a neighborhood that they know Grant frequents, and that is when they saw him leaving the home and then arrested him. They spotted this year Grant. He is now in police custody after escaping with that other inmate uh, from that uh, Northeast Philly jail. New pictures in from the U.S. Marshals Service. This year Grant arrested. Police say they saw someone leaving the house dressed head to toe and wearing a head covering. Police say it was Grant trying to hide his appearance, and he was arrested shortly. Shortly after, without any trouble. It came after police also arrested a 21 year old woman linked to helping the two men escape. Authorities say the inmates were able to get out through a hole in the fence during recreation time at the jail. Now, Grant was found after U.S. Marshals set up surveillance near 28th and Dolphin in that neighborhood. A male resembling uh, Nasir Grant came out of a residence wearing full female Muslim garb and a head covering. Um, I believe he was thoroughly surprised. Uh, he submitted to our commands, and it was pretty much an uneventful arrest, which is the way we like it. Yeah, now police are fully focused on finding Amin Hurst, 18 years old. He's still at large and had been charged with four separate homicides prior to the jailbreak. So clearly police believe he is dangerous and they're asking for tips from the public. At this point, nobody else has been charged for helping these inmates, including the people inside that home in North uh, Philadelphia where Grant was arrested. However, police say that anybody helping these inmates either after or before the escape could face some serious trouble. For now, we're live at police headquarters. Randy Gyllenhaal, NBC10 News. Randy, thank you. And you can count on NBC10 to bring you the latest developments in the continued search for Amin Hurst. Download the NBC10 app. You can have alerts and updates sent right to your phone.